Almost six decades ago, on this day, high schoolers risked their lives to make a stand and preserve the nation's democracy. That spirit lives on, evidenced by the recent candlelight revolution. President Moon Jae-in attended a ceremony to remember the historic movement in Daegu and also deliver a special address there. Hwang Ho Jun starts us off from the southeastern city. February 28, 1960 marked a milestone in Korea's democratic history when about 1,700 students from eight high schools in the southeastern city of Daegu took to the streets to protest then-President Lee Seung mans attempt to secure a fourth term in office through election fraud. It was the first student-led democracy movement since Korea was liberated from Imperial Japan in 1945. And on Wednesday, exactly 58 years later, a South Korean president took part in the very first government-recognized ceremony to commemorate the Daegu democracy movement. Until now, the only presidential observation of the date was made by President Kim Dae-jung 18 years ago when he went to a ceremony held by private citizens. President Moon Jae-in, in his speech to mark the day, stressed that the Daegu democracy movement was more than just a regional historic event. Rather, it's something the entire nation must remember. He said the student protests sparked a series of rallies across the nation, ultimately leading to the April 19th movement the same year and ending the authoritarian rule of the E administration. Moving to the present day, he pointed to the so-called candlelight revolution, the mass demonstrations that led to former President Park Geun-hye's impeachment and removal from office last year, saying the Daegu democracy movement was the start of it all. The February 28th protests were only recognized by the government as a legitimate democracy movement in 2010, 50 years later. And after a nationwide campaign in which more than 12 million signatures were gathered, including those of other democratic movement-related organizations, it was designated last month as a National Memorial Day. And that designation came with the support of the people of Gwangju, home to the May 18th democratic movement two decades later. President Moon praised Gwangju and Daegu for coming together to support making February 28th a National Memorial Day, despite deep-rooted regionalism and political differences. Hong Wojun, Arirang News.